So what would you say the easiest and the hardest position in volleyball is? Hardest setter? Mm, easiest. You can say it. Uh, <laughs> no, but for me, no. Opposite, I think. Really? How so? If you, if you combine everything in the game, an outside hitter, they need to receive, they need, they need to attack, they need to serve, and they need to block. Okay. They need to okay. defense, they need to organize in uh, reception, everything. Mm -hmm. A setter, every ball is passing on his hands. So if you don't have, if you don't have a good day, it's going to be a bad day because <laughs> yeah. you're going to yeah. touch <laughs> the ball in every... <laughs> Everything. Okay, we are there with Libero and opposite because they have like... Right. In the end, opposite, I need to attack the ball. It's That's my focus. I don't need to, of course, blocking mm -hmm. and serving, but it's not that it's a difficult, a really difficult position. I'm there on the right, right side, the ball comes, and they expect me to make the point. You or know. do something good with the ball. A Libero, you need to defense, you need to organize the reception. Uh... You need to do a lot. So if you watch it really simple, I think opposite is, I think, is the easiest. I think I might change my mind because opposite could be the easiest if you're not like a go-to opposite. That's true. If you're not like the go-to attacker and you're the opposite on the team, then your job's super easy. Because That's you're true. not getting any of like the, the balls at 24-24, 25-25. You're just getting some balls. You have to attack and everyone on the team has to attack pretty much. So you're just one of everyone and when it gets important, like trash balls, like we talked about, they're going to four now, so you don't have to deal with trash balls as much. And then if you have an outside, like, I don't know, Leon or somebody like that, they're going to get the ball, and I'm safe. Yeah, but That's he's true. right with the, with the fact it depends in which team you are playing. Uh, but I would say it's between opposite and Libro. But for me, the... Outside it is said a uh, middle for me is also a difficult position because but they're only on half the court though they're only on half the time that's yeah, a that's a big argument that everyone has you you need to be focused all the time and if you want to be a good good middle blocker you you have to really understand like, yeah that's yeah true. that's true that's I can true. be stupid and attack a ball and I'm opposite <laughs> <you know? laughs> and middle they need to understand the game if not you cannot play in this that's true but that's I true. do think that less light is shined on middles. So, if you have a bad day in the middle, you get yeah, away with it yeah, a lot more than like than, yeah, if you have a bad day as a setter, true. you're done. Yeah, if you have a bad true. day as like a go-to opposite, you're you're out of the game. Libero, if you have a bad day, they just pick on you and that's tough. Outside, yeah, you can have a bad day and maybe we don't give you as much balls, but you're still in reception. As a middle, you just if I'm having a bad day, perfect pass. I'm just gonna jump with the middle. <laughs> And, like, no one's going to really come to me and blame the loss on me. Yeah, that's, that's true. That's true. That's true. But you, you can't impact the I game as much. You can yes, hide. Yes, you, you can, can hide. hide. But if you want to be, be a, a good middle, good middle you it's need to be really, difficult, really good. It's yeah. a really difficult position. Because of, so, you have to actually stop the offense, yeah. and <laughs> nowadays that's hard. That's true. But so we, in America, we have this thing called middle brain, where it's like middles. Usually, I'll just say this. Say this. Sometimes the lowest IQ people are in the middle for some reason and they make probably maybe the lowest IQ volleyball plays on the court. Do you guys have that? That's definitely Do you have that correct. in the Netherlands? Do you have that in the Netherlands? Or has there ever been like a case where you're just like, what the hell is my middle doing right now? Or, or yeah, anything yeah. like that? A lot of times. But that's that's the thing. If you are if you are not a good middle blocker, you you pass fast to that. Yeah. Because if you see somebody in the middle, doesn't un he doesn't understand anything, you think, man, what is this guy doing? Because he's moving from left to right. <laughs> to right. So it's, it's, it's quickly looking stupid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So then it seems yeah. like, okay, the middles are the ones that yeah, not... But like the good middles, they need to be like yeah, the smartest. Yeah, yeah. 